Hey guys, Troy from the Do It Yourself World and the Off Grid Project, and my guest Sam, uh, which you met riding bikes the other day. Um, just a brief update: we uh, rode motorcycles for half a day. It was half a day, right? Four hours. And then um, we did some paintballing for I don't know how long that was, but it was a while. We did some paintballing in the forest, and I did not do any video for that because I'm sure that half the people would have had fits about the dangers and the horrors of it and the other half would have been excited so we just didn't do any video um what else have we done great that's exciting garage we had sale. a good <laughs> oh yeah what did we get at the garage sale that was really projector cool. screen oh the couch. um yeah, we went to a garage sale. We had to go to town for some stuff and uh, to take care of some business. Melanie's um, Melanie's uh, pregnancy. We're it, we're it's a 45 minute trip one way. The other day we had to go there, and that took up a good half of our day. Actually, it was it's usually an entire day. Was that Friday? Yeah, it was Friday. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't get back till around five, I think, in the afternoon. We had to leave in the morning. I think we left at 9 in the morning and didn't get back till 5 in the afternoon. So that was Friday. Saturday, uh, we were scouting out the land looking for deer hunting possibilities. Bit of maintenance. And I do not show that for to some people will be obvious reasons, but I keep my privacy uh, on certain things. And especially when it comes to hunting, I am not going to show my uh, the places I find for the best hunting which I think makes sense. Anyway, Saturday was spent scoping out the land and uh, finding good hunting places because hunting season is coming and Melanie and I do hope to provide our own food this year for the most part. Uh, Sunday I got heat exhaustion and I was sick and uh, that went on into Monday because we had mid, mid to high 80 temperatures, degree te temperatures in Fahrenheit with 79% um, humidity and uh, it kicked my butt. You can attest to that. What was I like yesterday? No brain. No. Yeah. <laughs> I was just. Couldn't think. I was just a vegetable. I was just lounging around. I wasn't worth. I couldn't do anything. But I was really sick. Anybody who's had heat exhaustion, you know what it's like. It's. You, it really makes you really physically ill. Anyway, um, today I feel a bit better. A little bit headachey, but it's cooler. I hope. And uh, it's still humid. So, but today we are taking a road trip and we're going to get a wood stove on the other side of Michigan. So, uh, I don't know how long it'll be, but this afternoon we're going to go on the road and um, I just wanted to give you an update today because we haven't done many videos um, and, you know, normally I try to do a daily video. Uh, we got a lot of exciting things to come. We're going to do some tactical stuff, some outdoor and survival things. This is the guy that was with me back in the day on Survival Island. And that was a good time. I think we all had fun. So uh, we hope to do some more exciting stuff here during his stay. And uh, you know, I'll get that over on the Tactical Channel. Also, we have some projects planned for the homestead. So uh, getting the wood stove is a big, big deal for us. Um, it's a catalytic wood stove, so it will burn pine wood cleanly. And I, I was stressed, and I'm sitting here looking around. All we have is pine. Everywhere is pine. How am I going to find a wood stove or how am I going to find hardwood to burn pine? And then I saw this wood stove that burns cleanly. It burns pine. So um, that's a blessing right there. So we're going to go get that today. Got a friend helping us with a vehicle. And uh, well, we'll see you when we get back. I have no idea what is, how long it's going to take. So what do you think of your stay so far? It was fun. About to shoot a couple guns. Oops. <laughs> don't tell your dad. <laughs> I yeah. don't care. That's right. We did have some fun and, and did some uh, some Bikes shooting. Were and fun. We did uh, fire some pretty awesome uh, military, vintage military weapons. Uh, military surplus. Yeah. And we got a lot more to come. So he's going to, uh, where he's from, you don't get to do that all that much. So we're going to have some fun. But you can do it. You just need a license. For everything. <laughs> yeah, you need a license to breathe, I think, right? Something like that. <laughs> Alright guys, well, we'll get inside. We got some packages came, and I was just down and out. I was not able to do anything the other day, so uh, Melanie's been like, can we open the packages? 
So let's go inside and open some packages. Hi guys, Troy and and Michelle. Really? <laughs> Michelle's gonna have a guy's voice? <laughs> no. no. So, hi. This is Troy and Melanie and Michelle from. Okay. She can't remember the do-it-yourself world and the off-grid project. We have a package that arrived the other day, and uh, I just was not fit to open it. I wasn't fit for anything. Melanie's not fit for opening it. I will take it and open it for you. Yes. <laughs> yes? No, here. I have my other package. My knife is getting dull. Sam, remind me later to sharpen my knife. Okay. Oh, look at the butterfly on it. There's a card. There's a box for Felix the cat. Here, Felix. Hey. Look at the big butterfly on it. Put those on the shelf. Yeah, I'm going to put these. <laughs> There's a card. Baby card. Hold, feed, love, kiss, hug, burp, and change. <laughs> they covered everything. Look. I think that's handmade. Yeah. I don't know. Dear Troy, Melanie, and sweet little Michelle. I hope she's going to be sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you enjoy these little baby things. We'll be praying for a safe delivery and quick recovery for you, Melanie. I can't wait to see your precious little bundle of joy. God bless you guys. Uh, from Brenda. Felix oh, is look at that. No little kitten anymore. Oh. <laughs> It's like a little ballerina thing. Yeah, what's, this? what's this? Oh, outlet plugs. Oh, you put them in the wall outlets big. and it stops the baby from electrocuting itself yeah. or frying things. Maybe the cats too, huh? Stop the feelings so from burning cute. stuff. Thank you. Oh, baby cat says, I want to be on video. Hi, baby cat. Say hi, baby cat. Really? Look at the other one. Smell. Oh, lovely. <laughs> lovely. Oh, this is fun. <laughs> That's so little. Oh boy, I can't believe this. And then the shoes. Oh, the little. It oh, I had to keep them. <laughs> this one. Oh, that. that's the different. Is that this? They're the same. Oh, okay. But you just have. Oh, you gotta fluff it up. Okay. <laughs> little kittens. Yeah. They're all adorable. Okay. Oh. It's like a here. sleeping dress or a gown. Yeah. Little rose on it, little pink rose. Thank you so much. Well, thank you. Well, one month left, guys. Just one month to go. If Melanie waits, I don't know. It doesn't look like she's going to wait. Well, got one more package. So uh, this one has my name on it. So while Melanie is packing that up, make sure the address isn't visible here. I forgot to take that one off here. Well, I'll try to just keep it hidden. Okay. 
nothing on that side. This is all the way from Ireland from my friend Goliath Man. As those some of you may remember, I visited Ireland a while back and uh, stayed with Goliath Man. Check out his channel. He does some uh, beautiful stuff with scenic Ireland. It's really a beautiful country. So some of this here, I have no idea what we're getting into here. So we have uh, some very, very good Irish coffee, which I love. Felix, Felix is a bully. Felix is a big bully. Yes. So there's some of my favorite Irish coffee. Chocolate. Yippee. Oh. There's another. Oh, I like it. I like it. Let me see. I think this must be what he said he had bought for me originally before I think you were around. Mm -hmm. He forgot to send it. That's a crystal. Let me see if I can get that out of there. I'm not going to fight with it. It's a really beautiful crystal. This says Ireland. I don't know how well that shows up on there in the camera. But we'll enjoy it together, won't we? Melanie will probably find a nice place to hang it up. Let me see, there's a, another cup of... It's the same brand, but a different kind. I love coffee. You love coffee. I love coffee. Okay, everybody loves coffee. Oh, there's another one. Oh, good stuff. Get my fix. We get my fix. I don't know what this big thing is. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, Sam, now you're going to have nightmares tonight. <laughs> we have to watch that leprechaun movie. You know the one with the little <laughs> leprechaun killing people? Ha, 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 ha. We'll hang this up next to his bed tonight. Huh? <laughs> Who needs a scarecrow now? <laughs> Who knows that movie, guys? Remember that? This little guy? We're going to watch that tonight and set this out next. We're going to sit on the coffee table next to where he sleeps. We'll come up in the night and say, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> oh, what's this? <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> That's really cute. Ireland, by the way, has a lot of sheep. Oh, Melanie. Coffee. Coffee, coffee again. Coffee. And then go oh, for the cats. We got something for the cats. Felix, you see this? Felix is bullying baby cat still. Felix. Cat treats. Felix! Got special food. <laughs> the baby knows. Baby come. Baby cat, look what I got. You know what that is, don't you? You had the baby knows. Well, thank you very much. There's something in the bottom here. No, oh, baby has claws. <laughs> ah, there you go. Um, that's a beautiful scene. Oh, we were there. That is cool. That's a mine where we figure my great something or other grandpa may have worked. And there's Goliath Man. Check out his channel. And thank you very much, my friend from another part of the world. All right, guys, we'll get this video up to you, and then soon we got to hit the road and go get our wood stove, and then we'll be further on our path to becoming fully off the grid. Talk to you later. Bye. Baby cat, are you thankful for the box? Say thank you, baby cat. Hey, say thank you, baby cat. Hey, baby, show your thanks. She understands me. She's just being... Yeah, the baby cat. That's, that's the baby cat. She's mad because Felix was beating on her. Baby got a box. Hey, Uncle Troy. Yes. I don't think anybody's going to sleep here tonight. <laughs>